You see the glamour, you see the speed, you see the raw talent of the drivers wrestling these beasts around the track at unthinkable speeds, pushing the limits of physics and making million dollar overtakes look like a Sunday drive. That's the F1 story we think we know. Stop it, get some help. But what if I told you the true unsung heroes? Oh my God, wow! The minds calculating every millisecond, predicting every variable and literally whispering instructions into the ears of gladiators aren't the ones behind the wheel. No! They're the ones behind the screens. We're talking about the engineers of Formula One. These aren't just mechanics with fancy degrees. Oh no. These are the unseen architects of victory and sometimes the silent witnesses to disaster. They operate under a level of pressure that would make a diamond blush, making split-second decisions that cost millions and constantly battling the most complex machines on the planet. This isn't just about technical expertise, it's about unparalleled mental resilience, ice cold nerves, and the most intense emotional roller coaster you can experience without actually being in the car. From managing microscopic tire wear to predicting a rogue rain shower halfway across the track, these are the brilliant minds who live and breathe data, strategy, and the relentless pursuit of perfection. And when things go sideways, they're the ones holding the whole fragile operation together. So, buckle up because we're about to pull back the curtain and show you why the real F1 battles are often won or lost in the minds of the men and women you rarely see in the spotlight. The calm in the chaos, the race engineer. When you hear those iconic radio messages, Smooth operator. Operator. the ones that are clipped, precise, and often sound eerily calm amidst the roar of a V6 hybrid, you're listening to the race engineer, this is the driver's primary link to the entire team, their co-pilot, their confidant, and sometimes their therapist, all rolled into one highly caffeinated human being. Their role is incredibly complex. Before the race, they're the ones who've spent countless hours with the driver, fine-tuning the car's setup, analyzing every millimeter of downforce, every click of suspension. During the race, they're responsible for literally everything related to that specific car. Tire strategy, fuel management, brake balance, power unit settings, and navigating traffic. They're processing real-time telemetry data that would melt most supercomputers, all while trying to decipher if the driver's my tires are gone means my tires are actually gone, or I'm just a bit annoyed right now. But perhaps their most crucial and utterly baffling skill is their psychological resilience. Imagine, you have a multi-million dollar car hurtling at 200 miles per hour, driven by an adrenaline-fueled athlete who just spun or has damage or is screaming about blue flags. Your job? to remain the absolute embodiment of calm. They're the emotional anchors. While the driver is in a hot, noisy, vibrating cockpit dealing with physical and mental overload, the engineer is the steady, rational voice guiding them through the storm. They know precisely when to push, when to console, and when to deliver bad news without causing a total meltdown. Go to the finish line, keep pushing, go to the line, keep pushing, go to the line. It's a delicate dance of data and human empathy. It's a relationship built on absolute trust. The driver has to implicitly trust that the voice in their ear is giving them the best, most accurate information, even when their instincts tell them otherwise. And the engineer? They have to trust their driver's feedback, even when it sounds like pure adrenaline-fueled chaos. This bond, forged in the fires of competition, is truly the ultimate marriage of man, machine, and master strategist. The data whisperers, performance and strategy engineers, if the race engineer is the voice in the driver's ear, then the performance engineer and the strategy engineer are the brains in the team's ear, the ones sifting through an ocean of data, predicting the future, and playing a high-stakes game of chess at 200 miles per hour. These are the data whisperers, the individuals who extract every last ounce of speed, not from the car's engine, but from its numbers. The performance engineer lives in the world of microseconds and millimeters. Their job is to constantly optimize the car's setup, analyzing every tiny piece of information that comes in from the track, tire degradation, aero balance, braking performance. They're like forensic scientists for speed, meticulously picking apart the data to find those hidden tenths of a second. They'll tell you why the left front tire is running 0.3 degrees hotter than the right front, and what that means for the next stint. They're the ones who might recommend adjusting a front wing angle mid-session to balance the car for qualifying or tweak damper stiffness to manage tire wear over a long race stint. They can even spot discrepancies between what the driver feels, 
I have understeer, and what the data shows. Actually, data indicates oversteer on corner exit. Let's adjust X. It's an obsessive, relentless pursuit of perfection in the details. But then you have the strategy engineer, the grand chess master. While the performance engineer is optimizing the current move, the strategy engineer is thinking 10 moves ahead, processing an almost terrifying number of variables, rival pace, potential safety cars, weather changes, pit stop timings, and the ever dreaded what if scenarios. They're the ones calculating whether an undercut or overcut will work to gain track position, or deciding in a split second under a safety car whether to pit both cars or stay out. They also forecast rain probability down to the percentage point, informing critical tire choices. Imagine trying to calculate the perfect pit window, factoring in how worn your tires are, how much fuel you have left, whether an opponent is about to undercut you, and the precise probability of a full course yellow, all while a million global viewers are screaming at their TVs for you to make the right call. The pressure is immense. A single wrong decision can cost millions, years of effort, and a championship. They're the ones who might tell a driver to pit when the sky is blue only for it to pour rain five seconds later, instantly making them the unluckiest genius in the room. These engineers don't just react, they predict, they model, and they essentially try to see into the future. They are constantly running simulations in the background, weighing risks against rewards, and trying to find the statistical edge that puts their car just one step ahead. It's an invisible battle, fought not with carbon fiber and horsepower, but with intellect, algorithms, and an unwavering belief in their calculations. The Silent Sentinels, design, aerodynamic, and power unit engineers. While the race engineers and strategists are busy with the live show, there's another army of brilliant minds working behind the scenes, away from the pit wall's glare. These are the Silent Sentinels, the design engineers, the aerodynamicists, and the power unit engineers. They are the ones spending countless hours in hushed labs and intense design offices, meticulously crafting every single component of these incredible machines. Their relentless pursuit of perfection in the tiniest details is what makes an F1 car a cutting-edge marvel, rather than just a very fast bathtub. The design engineers are the literal architects of speed. They translate concepts into tangible parts, designing everything from a single washer to an entire chassis. These are the geniuses behind the incredible strength of the monocoque, the life-saving halo device, or the intricate lightweight components of a gearbox that can handle thousands of shifts per race. Their world is one of complex CAD models, stress tests, and finding that impossible balance between strength, lightness, and aerodynamic efficiency. These are the folks who agonize over a few grams, knowing it could mean the difference between winning and losing. Let's just say they secretly judge your IKEA furniture assembly skills. Then you have the aerodynamicists, the ones who truly believe in magic. But it's the magic of airflow. They're obsessed with every single ripple, curve, and angle of the car's bodywork. They spend endless hours in wind tunnels and running complex CFD simulations, designing everything from the intricate barge boards and floor edges that create downforce to the subtle curves of the rear wing that reduce drag. Their job is to make the air work for you rather than against you. They're the ones who'd probably tell you a slightly raised eyebrow could add drag to a helmet. Their gains might be microscopic, but they're absolutely crucial, often the secret source that determines a car's overall performance. And finally, the power unit engineers. This is where the raw grunt of F1 lives. They design, develop, and manage the hybrid power unit, squeezing out every last horsepower while ensuring reliability and efficiency under extreme stress. They meticulously optimize combustion efficiency, manage the complex energy recovery systems, MGUK, MGUH, and constantly tweak engine maps to deliver peak performance at every circuit. Their work is shrouded in secrecy, with each team's power unit being a closely guarded secret source that can define an entire season a secret source that would make Colonel Sanders jealous. The competition for that fractional increase in power or that slight improvement in fuel efficiency is absolutely brutal. These engineers rarely get the camera time and their names aren't shouted on the podium, but they endure immense pressure. The fear of a component failure that could sideline a car, the relentless cycle of innovation driven by ever tightening regulations and the constant battle to find that hidden advantage. They pour their lives into creating components that might only be seen for a few seconds on track. But without their unwavering dedication and genius, these F1 cars would simply be very expensive, very fast paperweights. The unseen battle, mental fortitude and resilience. So we've talked about the incredible intelligence, the meticulous detail and the constant innovation. But all of that pales in comparison to the sheer mental fortitude and unflappable resilience required to survive, let alone thrive, in Formula One. 
These engineers aren't just pushing numbers, they're pushing their own limits every single race. Imagine the emotional whiplash. One moment, you've orchestrated a perfect pit stop and an incredible undercut, watching your car sail past a rival to win. The euphoria is immense, the culmination of months, sometimes years, of unseen work finally paying off. You high five, you hug, you allow yourself a fleeting moment of pure, unadulterated triumph. And then, the next moment, it's all gone. A mechanical failure you couldn't have predicted, a rogue piece of debris, or a strategy call that just didn't pay off despite all your meticulous planning. That crushing weight of knowing your genius, your hard work, just evaporated in a puff of smoke or a lost tenth of a second. There's no blaming the driver, no pointing fingers. The burden is shared, and often, silently carried. They learn to compartmentalize, to instantly pivot from despair to problem solving. There's no time to dwell. The next session, the next race, is always just around the corner. The F1 calendar is a relentless grind, a global odyssey of long hours, constant travel, and precious little sleep. These engineers spend more time with telemetry screens than their own families, living a life of perpetual deadlines and immediate public consequences. Every decision is scrutinized, every error amplified. Yet, they show up, week after week, with that same laser focus, that same unwavering dedication. They are the epitome of professionalism under pressure. So, the next time you watch an F1 race, and you see that incredible machine flash by, or a driver cross the finish line in glory, take a moment to remember the true brains behind the wheel. The unsung heroes who calculate, design, strategize, and endure. They are the unseen architects, the data whisperers, the silent sentinels, fighting their own intense battle for every fraction of a second. They are the very pulse of Formula One, proving that raw talent is only half the story. The other half is pure genius and an iron will forged in the relentless pursuit of perfection. Did this script rev your engines? What F1 engineering detail blows your mind? Let us know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the hidden world of F1, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel for more behind the scenes F1 content, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss our next pit stop.